Welcome back to Trend Wins, Death Row to Canada. Tonight is August 5th, 2016. It's Friday, it's very late. Probably, it's about 15 minutes from midnight. And several new characters have jumped into the game. Uh, there's an in new AI mode. And various bug fixes. We'll see um, just how many changes there are. Here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go with my Civilized Mechanic as my primary, and then uh, one of the recommendations was to have a Paranoid person. That was uh, recommended on, on by a guide writer for the game. So, uh, let's see how that goes. And Paranoid is pretty much what Soldier had. So uh, He didn't have the trait, he just had... He had the same options a paranoid person might get because of his wits and attitude combination. So it's these two combined now. Familiar character mode. Most road recruits you meet are now familiar characters instead of random. These are characters that you created and saved. Make your friends and family and they'll show up in the game. Wow. Carry like really, really negative. Oh, okay, never mind. It, it changed. I was gonna say the morale is really bad. Try to remember how to play. It's been a couple of weeks. Oh yeah, the, I think the throw has changed too. So the pickup button is no longer the drop button. I just have to figure out what it is. I think it might be. I think it's supposed to be like a swap button or something. Still, that is strange to call this a swap move. I'm not sure what that actually means. Oh, there's some bullets back here. It's too bad uh, the characters are unhappy. Or, I mean, not unhappy, but um, the attitude is poor. Well, it might lower Carrie's attitude, but it might raise Starrett's star attitude. So I tried giving them names, so they've basically been... they. First, they started with a class name, then they kind of had a more uh, distinct name in that class, and now I kind of branched out into even further. So, it's like, there's a set of tools named the Starret tool, or, or company, that they, they, make, they make a certain kind of toolbox. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured would happen. So, so the happy person got, ha got happier, and the negative person got sadder. So now I'm, I'm evened out. Which works for me. I wonder, if I make- if I give you a self-help look and positivity, you can still have all the paranoid options, right? You just won't be um, negative in my team, right? So I'm, I'll, I'll make you more positive as a person. It didn't help that considerably. <laughs> So 
So here is a new option. Smashing as melee. They'll, they'll hit things with close combat weapons. Shooting is, you know, as explains, your, your characters will just start blasting others. Tactic. Um, running. I think it's fully passive. You don't actually, they, they won't actually spend any time attacking anything. Fighting, I think they will advance towards zombies near you. The original or default status that they used to be at is called either and defend. Although probably balanced might be more appropriate for combat um, as a name. So because it, that way the label itself is standalone or you know is is uh, you can discuss it instead of like set yourself to balanced. People would immediately know other than that. Not, I was trying to figure out why he says nothing next to Star and Carry. Trying to figure out what the drop button is. So the drop button is a swap button now. So to pick it up, I use the uh, the use button, which is the button on my left. And then the, the bottom button on my control pad is swap weapon. That's what I would use to drop the chairs and stuff that I'm about to throw. And I, I either attack, which is the right button, or the use button, the left or the right one, is what throw. But now, I understand that that's supposed to be things are more intuitive, I suppose. But really, you could just let us pick exactly what we want to do what buttons. I don't think I have a problem with it. I'm not sure if, it, if I'll even notice that it's been changed.
this series has brought a great number of viewers to my channel. Thankful for that. However, the the last episode of my normal mode, which has the greatest number of viewers short of my Dead Island speedrun, it was suddenly disabled for monetization, and I don't know why. I don't believe it falls any, under any of their standard guidelines for disabling monetization, such as being too violent, and since this is a pixelated violence here. I know I understand that killing zombies is considered violent. I don't believe there's any sexual content. I don't think profanity is an issue. I, I don't. I'm not like I, I. I don't think that that's something that could keep some from getting monetized. But definitely, my in my case, I don't really swear a lot, if at all. Um, I do have expressly written permission to make to monetize these videos. I'm not sure what I, I'm not. I'm not really sure what the problem might be. Was just healing. So I, I'm I, I'm not sure if that flashing strength means like even lower than low, like negative number. It might be because she is technically tired. Whoops. Put that up. I don't actually need to be hollering that around. Alright, so among the characters I have, I have one character from each one of my uh, playlists, and then characters from my favorite... I mean, I had to think of something. Movies. So this one's Johnny Rico uh, from Starship Troopers. Well, it's Rico. He, he's considered practical. He's he's good with a rifle. Well, it's Rico. It's nice to see a familiar face. He's fighting a single zombie, then suddenly trips and falls down. He gets really embarrassed when he notices the group. It's early. I'm going to go ahead and say no, because I need to stockpile food. That sort of seems to be a really successful strategy I employed last time. Is, is uh, Early on, just keep salvaging and salvaging and salvaging, and then towards the end, pick up someone. Three people seems to be good, because the fourth one just sort of sits in the back and does nothing. But I'll try to get four this time. I wasn't really intending just to end up with three, but that's how it worked out. And I did previously think that three was all I would need anyways. Unfortunately, I now have a siege, so Rico would have been nice here. This house is pretty big. Maybe someone will walk in. The game was crashing.
Not the brightest way to back into a corner there. You had a whole open aisle behind you. Pushing me into them? I can't defend you if I have to cover more territory. Like, I wasn't walking forward, she was shoving me into them. I don't really know if it's my imagination. I don't really think the old AI did any of this stuff. Let's live here forever. The area is clear. No, I don't really get a lot of um, strength, I think. I, I would prefer fitness, personally. But I need to level up my strength sometime if I ever want to two-star any of those early things. Uh, I mean, other perks. Why would my attitude decrease? I feel smug. Fine. So that, basically that book that I picked was worthless. I should pick something else. Whoa, it's Boar. It's nice to see a familiar face. He's eating a candy bar. Those things still haven't gone there. So this is Warrior. Um, I think I named him... At first I started by looking up some Roman gods for all of the original custom characters that didn't have anything immediately related to them. And I think one of the symbols for uh, a god of fighting, it might have been Ares or something, um, was a boar. Decided that that looked like a good biker nickname, boar. As if I didn't have enough medical problems. Just in case. Get a nail board. I don't think it matters right now. Oh, I can stack things up without having to go back through. Oh. 
And then we'll spin around, pick Star up wherever we left her. I don't know, should we even bother camping? I don't like camping. Like, I can kind of deal with being tired. Oh, uh, well, I think, I think if I keep driving, I could get the event where I end up crashing my car, so let's just camp. No, resting that twice in that area should have given me like free healing. Just like a little, little bit. Or maybe some morale. I mean if we if we have to eat twice in in a safe area that we didn't get attacked in. That should be worth something. Resting for, for half a day or however long it was. Apparently it's nighttime now, so. I don't know why you turned around. I didn't tell you to turn around.
That was kind of pointless. I wasted all that ammo for nothing. I thought I could loot the house, but I searched at last. The group sets up camp outside a grocery store. They notice another group has been following them. They will probably attempt to loot the place. Now this one's a loyalty test. If your loyalty is not good, that character will just disappear, which this sucks. I know Starrett has good loyalty. I would kind of like what learn what Car Carrie's loyalty is. We need to heal, though. It's sure nice to get some medical, finally. The game knows I'm in a car, right? He's about seven bullets and eleven or twelve shotgun shells. Personal treasures is morale. Let's just do the half my ammo. Not qu quite half, but I'll take it. Omni Biocore Lab. Oh, it's late afternoon. So now it should be morning, hopefully. Oh, uh, we'll it goes to late afternoon again? Alright, so I have to find these people in an apartment building. But it's not a siege, so there's that, thankfully. Alright, I don't know what star it's leading now, but yeah. I wanted you to lead anyways.
Livonia says that she really wants to get out of this place. She asks if she could follow you around. But I can't check her equipment out. I should send medical. Maybe I'll take that. Let's see here. I need two, four, f six medical in order to heal up. I've got three. Let's just do it. Even though I really would prefer the fitness training. Her loyalty is good. Her, but her attitude and composure are bad. Don't really need any of that. She has a crowbar, that's about it. Alright, let's get the medical. I like that the uh, mini- or not mini-map. That the game tells you where people are. When you're in town. Apparently not that we use charm on that. I wanted another sturdy machete, frankly. Well, that's still a better, better event than my first trader. Mm. Oh yeah, I've got some decent mechanics. I'm not sure if it's enough to repair a hybrid car though. Oh, come on. You guys are best buds. Oh, police station. <laughs> I mean, the restaurant's good too, but... To win the game, you need bigger weapons. You can survive quite some time without food. I don't know if weapons get better as you progress in the game. So, for example, if I go to police station now, would that... Um, but I only find newbie weapons, and if I did a police station later, would I find better weapons? I'm not worried about like using them on police station or something like that. I'm just mean like I have a choice between getting food or weapons. And I'm considering that what the quality of those weapons might be. Let's go and go to the police station, because I could use some bullets anyways. I might find some there. It is late afternoon, which I'm not terribly fond of fond of, uh, so. My only dislike is it's going to be nighttime real fast. This made the trip worthwhile. Is 
think they went to the door to the right, so let's sneak out. Generally, I like the secure the lobby. Try not backing into a wall. In fact, that's how I wasted most of my early medical. Over here. I've already been bitten once. It looks like I have to survive the rest of the night while I search the rest of the town. Well, I could try hiding in here until daytime. Uh, the zombies will just continue to spawn anyways. It's not like they wander away. That would be a nice mechanic, though, is if they also could wander away. So uh, it would mean hiding inside a house till daytime worth something. So does the ding mean I found like a rare item? A useful item in that room? I should look carefully or what? Okay, 
what seems to help is uh, running deep inside the building when the zombies are following you into the building. They kind of, it feels like they kind of lose interest and want to start dispersing a little bit. Or maybe not always, and maybe it's just my imagination. for a baseball bat. Baseball bats can break too. I don't know what that ding means. Is it just a glitchy sound effect? We're opening a door? Yeah, so yeah, maybe it's just time to walk. Okay, this is dependent on fitness. Um, I'm not tired, but I didn't, haven't raised my fitness at all. The mechanic, I think you start with fitness and... I mean, I, th I think you start with fitness, not strength. I don't think it's enough fitness to climb a tree though, so I'm just gonna keep... Mm. How much medical do I have? I have enough medical. Let's do it. Let's, climb, let's try climbing this tree. Maybe that isn't related to... I don't know. My, my fitness is horrible. Not the worst, though, but I made it. I managed to succeed in doing it. Alright, so all, really all I get is, is I, I lost one morale for each person, and I revealed my fitness, and then I get morale back. So I lost morale for Carrie, and that's it. And I revealed my fitness. That was the penalty for me running away from my car. Alright, so I've got... These are all permanent weapons, they'll never break. Neither were the hatchet. The hatchet's great. So I, I would probably use the hatchet over the wrenches, frankly. The sturdy machete horror is better than even those. Since I have some good weapons, even though it's nighttime, it might be worth trying to clear out my area. Because it's early, I might be able to do that. We'll see. I feel like the AI just keeps getting itself bit, though. 
Again, I don't know if it's a matter of me getting better than the first time I played the game, and now the AI just can't keep up, or if the AI has actually gotten worse. I'm not sure which. See, there's a gas right in front of me, but just move. Just go. Well, what? <laughs> there's only two people. Can we not just ignore this? Okay. Star explains a complicated sequence of deduction that arrives at one conclusion. The fart was made by a ghost! Whoa! Everybody's morale increases. Okay, I'll, I'll take that. Yeah. You know, just bring that morale up. I, I know that sounds sarcastic, but it's not. You know, I, I want, I'm all for getting that morale up. Go ahead and chop some wood, Star. Get some more strength. Cherry is my shooter, Star. That's my melee. Star tries building up the Sunless defenses. Tries to fortify some things, but the others didn't seem to help much. What? I've never failed before. I had, I had, I had good mechanical skill. Rifle, or I think that's a rifle there. Hard to tell. I get rifles and shotguns in this game mixed up. I hope they eventually change the graphics of them. So it's shotgun ammo to the left. Oh, this must be the shotguns then. One anything. Not not just a regular shotgun. Although I haven't found one yet, I, don't, I still don't want to buy one. You get a hunting rifle for 15 food. That's not a bad deal, I guess. A wooden star, maybe. Well, let's just keep going. We should start a convoy. Maybe offer to sell my van to one of the merchants. That would be a good deal. can go through this at all, I don't think so. That, that's a pretty crappy place to be when the zombies spawn like that. No! Get- Jeez! You were the one that was supposed to be safe! Ha! 
Okay, I know you are going the wrong direction, people. Darn it, I dropped my machete. Emily will get a drink. Be right back. This one's for... I forget the name already. <laughs> this one's for a mechanic. Start. Alright, I'm back. It's really stupid, but... Yeah. This entire... Drive has been me yelling at the AI for running into the zombies. You should get like a double bonus if you're the only survivor. Just to help keep your team going. Mm, I don't know if I should even bother. Yeah, just let's hold on to everything. Oh. 
I think kicking is always beneficial, but I'm not positive. Alright, so how about letting me see some new new recruits now, because I definitely need it. Well, it's Jovian. It's nice to see a familiar face. He was found trying to pull open the door that said push on it. Alright. Well, I give him health care in case I ever needed some extra medicine, and I actually do. I think I have zero medicine. So yeah, he has seven medicine and is now joining my team. He, he, he doesn't have the same mechanical skills um, Starret does. Uh, I, I'm not going to have to rely on Carrie's paranoia. Let's just go. So maybe it won't be nighttime. Here we go. Um, I can attempt to rescue someone. That'll be good. This side, so the door is closed on this side, so new zombies won't immediately attack me. This side. Up in this whole direction? That was lame. There's a zombie bouncing around back there. See what I mean? Like you're gonna use up all your medicine on yourself.
So this entire hallway was a waste of time.
Darren catches up with the group. I can get group medical or group strength. Um, I guess let's just get group medical. Let's see if we can get um, Jovian enough medical that he'll heal me with no resources. I was planning on making Kari do it, but, or Kari, I never really know how to say her name. She'll be tired, but her strength and fitness aren't anything to write home about anyways. Sunset? That's not right now. I mean, I don't like having aggression hunting, but the swarm is my own, so let's do it. It's also in the morning. bring weapons that I can afford to discard if I find really awesome gear. If it's a town, I think I should be able to access my car. I'm not positive. I don't know. If it's a town, I should really bring my good gear. It's not a town. Can I access my car? No. I don't read something about it, I thought. Maybe not. Maybe it's just a suggestion and not an actual thing that's going on. Whoa! Yeah, that's, uh, let's back up then. We can lure some of them out. I gotta go check for a sec. Alright, back.
Played Red Dead. This is kind of like cattle wrestling, weaving back and forth to keep him in the ball. Let's see what's in that last room. Nothing. Zombies. Not exactly a fantastic amount of gear. I mean, I was hoping for like guns and stuff. I don't think I have a mechanic. Jovian represents, uh, I think, the idea of healing. I mean, obviously. Forget how it relates, though. Alright, well, you have the highest wits, so let's see what Jovian's wits are. I don't know. Alright, this is Williams, um, as in the Bruce Campbell character from Evil Dead. So, for, for traits, I gave him Charming and Fighter. I feel that fits his character pretty well. So, let's, let's bring Ash Williams to the team. He won't actually help us that much, but at this point, I kind of need more people now. Um, we have seven days left, so I've already used up half my time. Alright, well, we can shoot the cans and raise everyone's pistol, but morale will drop. Well, let's go ahead, because I want to I wanna, I wanna really get that shooting skill up.
I want to see what it's like to have a good gunner. Near noon. I guess that's not too bad. Let's see what the house has. So you have a hatchet. That's pretty good. Probably my best nail layer, so I'll put you in front. What I'd like to do is I like to knock the zombies down with a bludgeon weapon, and then while they're down, chop them up with an edged weapon. I, I don't know if that is better than just straight up attacking them. I, I feel like that's a pretty good combo. Let's see how this works. Uh, oh, they are on fighting already. Okay. Must have left that on from my previous net. So even though uh, they're not hostile yet, fighting will make me attack them. Which is fine. Let's go and put defense and let's get these weapons out of their hands. Of course, I gotta go pick up some more. Anything useful in this house? Something to find like hunting rifles, food, anything really. Twelve bullets, ten shotgun shells. It's essentially what I found.
There's a gun. This is not too bad of a find. It's the only thing I've picked up here. Say that as they grab a piece of wood on their way out. That's my loot. Kill more zombies and I get loot. Let's clear up some of this stuff. Because I was fortunate to get some good weapons, I don't actually need to worry about carrying extra disposable weapons. My disposable weapons are like the nightstick and the frying pan. 